Now what the question says is a plus b plus c we have represented is equal to c plus d plus e. This summation what all we have got abc summation, cde summation, efg summation and ghi summation each of them is 13. Representation form we have kept this. Now let's say if we add everything once abc plus c plus d plus e plus e plus f plus g plus g plus h plus i 13 13 13 and 13 summation becomes 52 if we add everything once we don't know who is what but if we add everything once what all we get here is g plus h plus i if we add everything once if we add everything once what all we get here is i'll write for a better understanding part we already know one of them is 1, 1 is 2, 1 is 3, we don't know who is what, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9, summation is going to be 45 and if we subtract, if we subtract A, B, C it's once, D, E once, F, G once, H, I once, what we are left out with is C plus E plus G is 7. C plus E plus G, all the three are different variables. Now even if we take lowest to lowest, summation is 6, but we know it's summation 7. So either it can be 2-2-3 two, two, combination, but 2 cannot be same. It can be 1-3-3 three, three combination, 2 will be same. So the only possible combination is 1-2-4. We don't know who is what. We don't know who is what out of C plus E plus G7. One of them is 1, other is 2 and the third one is 4. Now it can be various possible combinations, first quickly what we were given ABC, CDE, EFG, GHI summations 13, 13, 13, 13, addition we get 52. If we add everything once we get 45. So if we subtract then we get 7 and the only possible of 3 different things which can give summation 7 is 1, 2 and 4. Now, Question asked is we already know C plus E plus G is 7, C plus E plus G is 7 and one of them is 1, 1 is 2. Question asked is about E. Now if we take E is 1, C and G, any one is 2 and the other one is 4. Let's say we take C is 4, 2, so G will be 4. Now C plus D plus E, C plus D plus E summation has to be 13 and if we say this is 1, this is 2, this has to be 10. But a variable maximum possible value here is given is 9. So what we know is E cannot be 1, means E cannot be 1 if E is 1, we don't know but if E is 1. C and G, one of them is 2 and one is 4, but if this is the case, D will become 10 or if G is 2, F will become 10. Maximum permissible values here are given 9. So what all we get? This is not possible. E cannot be 1. Let's try E being 2. Let's say we try E2. So one of them has to be remaining 2, one of them has to be 1 and the other has to be 4. These are interchangeable, we don't know who is what. If we take E is 2, 1 is 1 and 1 is 4. Any one of them is 1, any one of them is 4. Now if this is 1, again this will be 10. If this is 1, this will be 10, which is not possible. So what all we get here is, it cannot be, E cannot be 2 also. So compulsorily what we know is E has to be 4 and remaining 1 to interchanging is possible. If we take E is 4, we don't know who is what. One of the remaining is 1, other is 2. If this is 1, we are not sure. What we are sure is E has to be 4. That is the only thing which is asked. Means C has to be 1 or 2 and g has to be 1 or 2. It depends if this is 1, this will be 2. If this is 2, this will be 1. But if this is 1, 4 plus 1, 5. 
4 plus 1 5 so d will become 8 because 13 and if this is 2 this will become 7 and the same way here if this is 2 7 or 8 means out of d and f 1 is 7 or 8 so finally as you can see all are possible answers we are not sure about them what we are sure is e has to be 4 now again if c is 1 this summation will be 12 if g is 2 this summation will be 11 again it depends who is 2 and who is 1 this can be 12 or 11 this can be 11 or 12 now whichever will be 11 look already we have used 1 2 4 7 and 8 what all are left out are 3 5 6 and 9 so where all 12 will come will be 9 and 3 and this will be again who is what we don't know anything it's all going to be depending on what all we get at that time we cannot surely say the only thing we can surely say is e has to be 4 e has to be 4 simply what we had got was we were given quick check abc summation 13 cde summation 13 efg summation all the four 52 if we take everything once 45 so we get c plus e plus g is 7 now c plus e plus g 7 the only possible combination is 1 2 4 now if it's 1 2 4 e can be 1 or 2 or 4 if we try 1 anyone comes 10 2 we tried it came 10 so only possible if we take e 4 7 or 8 7 or 8 it depends so what all we get e has to be 4 a very commonly asked question time